right everyone today you join me at Carey Lake Viaduct Fishery um, today we're just going for some of the bigger carp in here although I like a carp even if it's small because I haven't been out for a while um, last time I went fishing I went Rebels Fishery didn't have that many fish on I'm gonna try and change that today um, here at Carey uh, I'm just gonna be fishing an essential cell wafter um, on just a spinner rig I reckon that will work quite well here. I know it's worked well last time when we fished here. I actually did a YouTube video here not long ago. Um, back in February, I think it was. It might have been a bit later. Uh, but yeah, let's, let's get the um, rig sorted out. One of the essential cell wafters, you've had a little mirror. Look at that. Lovely little mirror. Can't believe that. Literally, missed a run, and then I had this. I think we're going to have a good day, people. <laughs> Lovely. Two tone, too. Look at that. Right, guys, um, so as you just saw, I had that little fish, although I was playing a big fish after that. Um, I got it in, got it netted, got it on the mat, and it just wasn't behaving, and I wasn't gonna risk, you know, like hurting a fish, so I just, in the end, stuck her back because I didn't want her to, like, hit this or anything, but yeah, that's the only bad thing about these swims, is they're so small, you can't really have enough space. But yeah, I'll definitely be, um, hopefully catching another one. Uh, and then getting a good picture of that. Bit disappointed though. Was definitely would have been the biggest of the day, I do think. But maybe we'll make up for it and get another one. Alright guys, so I was surface fishing in. I think it's um Lodge Lake, I'm not sure though. And I've just had this lovely fully scaled mirror. Bit deformed but still a lovely fish. Right guys, an essential cell wafter screamed off. A lovely little mirror. Lovely little fish. There you go. Right everyone, my first ever beluga carp. <laughs> PB beluga carp, look at his head. Right everyone, so it's just coming up about midday now. I'm on about six carp I'd say. Some of them I didn't um, get videos of just because they've been playing up too much. I don't want to keep them out of the water for too long. Um, but yeah, most of them I've got videos of. Uh, I just chucked the rods back out about 15 minutes ago and I'm going to wait here until I get another bite and then maybe go and get a tea. Nice little mirror. There you go guys. Lovely little fish. Essential cell wafter. Right guys, just managed to bag myself this little mirror. Lovely colours on this one. Nice dark fish. Lovely scale on it. Stunner. <laughs> Lovely little mirror guys, essential cell wafter. Doing the biz again. Lovely fish. There you go. Right everyone, so I thought I'd just take the time to show you what rig I'm using. So I'm actually sat on it. But you've got a little one foot leader there. Oh, my rod fell over. So you've got a one foot leader, and then I can't read it, but I think that's a 3.3 ounce lead um, on just a fox lead clip system. And then you've got 15 pound boom. I don't know how much that is. That's probably about four inches worth. Uh, and then a size six spinner hook on a Ronnie swivel with an essential cell wafter. And that is what has been catching me today. I haven't caught on anything else. I've tried other baits, but this one seems to be the one that stands out the most. Uh, but yeah, lovely little rig, and this is what always catches me carp here at least on Kerry Lake. 
There you go, everyone. Baby little mirror on an essential cell. Wafter, lovely little fish. There you go, lovely fish. Let's get them back. Right, everyone, I've got what seems to be a decent sized carp in the net. I'm going to bring her up here now onto the mat and let's have a look at her. Look at the size of it. Chunk of a mirror. There you go, everyone. Lovely little mirror. Well, I say little. Probably the biggest one I've had all day. Lovely fish. Look at that. Look at that everyone. Right guys, biggest mirror of the day. Look at that. Monster. Monster fish. Look at that. Absolute beast. Whoa. Right everyone, so this is the new rig that has been catching me carp. So this is a um, hybrid stiff. This, this is 20 pound hybrid stiff with a size six wide gape barbless, um, the quarter basics one. And then you've got a uh, live system I think it is, uh, boily, chopped in half and made like that, I don't really know what to say, maybe inverted, um, and then obviously the 3.3 um, or the 3.5 ounce lead, sorry, and the one foot leader, and that is the rig that has been doing me the business, right in the margin, just there, like literally, right there, has been catching me fish, so yeah, pretty chuffed for that, um, they've been nice runs too. Right guys, so we got a nice little carp in the net again. Um, the last two have been like above 15, so that's pretty impressive. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go get him now and bring him up to the mat. Um, and then I'll hook him, do what I need to do. Another beast of a mirror. Get in, look at that. Oh my god, body range! This is like the worst possible timing. It is. He come off. I think I'm gonna click. Right guys, so we got a nice little common. All the fish in here. Oh, breeze. Flippy flippy. Yeah. One. Lovely little common. Lovely common, there you go. Some nice scales on top of it. Wow. Lovely fish. Right guys, sadly it's time we have to go now. Uh, had loads of 17 pounders. Um, but yeah, I was just grabbing the last bit and any bits of rubbish that we missed. Uh, but yeah, absolutely insane session. I love this place so much. It's just a shame the fish's mouths are a bit battered. But yeah, lovely place, good session. But I'm afraid it's time to go home. So I appreciate everyone that's watched. I appreciate that. Uh, Remember to like and subscribe and also drop a comment if you have any questions. But yeah, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next video, hopefully soon.